The current Lakeland Animal Shelter facility was built 40 years ago and was originally designed to house approximately 25 cats and 25 dogs. We have been housing anywhere from 40 to 60 dogs and 200 to 500 cats for over a decade now. So needless to say, we have outgrown the space of the current facility. So from that, we decided we definitely need to have a new structure that will both house the animals efficiently and safely, but also allow the people to reach the animals and interact with them. What we decided to do for the new facility was build it in phases. Thanks to generous donations of over a million dollars, we were able to build phase one of the project, and that's the adoption center that, that we're ready to open now. Um, that facility will actually become our new open to the public area where we have space for adoptable cats, adoptable small animals, adoptable small dogs, and even we were excited to be able to build part of phase two, and that's actually what we're standing in right now. We have the shell built for phase two, but we have all of the internal structures that still need to be built. One of the drawbacks of operating the adoption center and the current facility at the same time is that a lot of the animals, including all of the large dogs, are gonna be over at the old facility, the care center. And in order to meet with them, they're gonna to have to come over, which is not gonna be ideal. Hopefully we'll be able to, with your support, raise the additional 1.6 million that we need to in order to bring all of the animals and the people under one roof. By finishing phase two, we will be able to save quite a bit on our annual operating expense budget. In particular, we'll be able to do on-site spay-neuter surgeries and save anywhere from 100 to 150,000 each year. Every amount helps, whether it's $5 or $5 million. It helps us finish the project. We have opportunities for marble tiles, for bricks, for sponsorship of individual cage spaces, for sponsorship of individual rooms. But most importantly, every amount that's given allows us to move forward with finishing this phase of the project. For example, $100,000 allows us to finish the framing for the interior. Another $100,000 allows us to put in the kennels. And another $50,000 allows us to put in the cat areas. All of it helps get us to that end goal of finishing. We're appreciative at the generosity that has gotten us to this point. It's almost surreal that we're actually standing in our new facility, even standing in phase two of our new facility. We are so close. We need your help to get there, to finish the project, to build the shelter, to bring all the animals under one roof. <laughs>